Right, today we are going to make something absolutely decadent. It's one of my guilty pleasures, so we're gonna hold nothing back. We're going to be making French toast grilled cheese sandwich with bacon. Yeah, you got it. savory and sweet. The French toast is going to be crispy on the outside, custardy in the middle with ooey gooey cheese and bacon. Oh, it's gonna be one hell of a sandwich. So let's get going. First, pan on. We're gonna cook our bacon until it's nice and crisp. While the bacon is cooking, we're gonna set the oven to 350 degrees and preheat it. We're gonna need that to finish off the sandwich later. Well, now the bacon is cooked through, so we're gonna transfer that onto some paper towels and let it drain. We got sharp orange cheddar and we are going to grate it. What we're gonna need is a day old brioche bun. Mmm, that smells good. But if you don't have a day old bread, and if you have a fresh one, put it in the oven at 275 degrees for a couple of minutes and let it dry out. We need a bread that's dense and can soak in all the egg, the custard, and hold it. To start with the French toast, one of the most important things is the slices. They can't be too thin because right off the bat, that's a disaster. Our inch thick is a perfect thickness. For the custard base, we need eggs and milk. We're gonna use half and half. These are the two main ingredients. It's also how you season the custard. It gives the distinct taste to the French toast. Today, we're gonna to be using a dash of cinnamon, vanilla extract, and nutmeg. If you're bold enough, go ahead and add some spice rum or Grand Marnier to kick it up a notch. We're gonna also add a teaspoon of powdered sugar for the sweetness and a pinch of salt. So we have our custard base now ready. Next, we're gonna cook the toast. We're not gonna use oil, we're gonna use butter. But remember, butter has a low heating point. So we're gonna cook on medium to medium low so as not to burn the toast before it's cooked through. Super soaked bread. We are going to toast these for two to three minutes on each side. Oh, absolutely. After. Absolutely beautiful golden brown. After two to three minutes on each side, we're gonna transfer them to a baking sheet. And now, we're going to get this loaded with cheese. Top it off with bacon. and more cheese. Right, now, lift this bad boy, and voila. Now we're gonna finish this off in the oven at 350 degrees for seven to eight minutes. Seven minutes are up. Now we're gonna get the sandwich out of the oven. So it should be a fluffy, custardy French toast with ooey gooey cheese sandwich. There you go. We have our fluffy grilled cheese French toast with bacon sandwich. So let's cut into it and let's see the insides. There you have it, Ooh, bacon, cheese, 
a fresh dose. So let's see how it tastes. Mm. Mm. That was absolutely decadent, as I told you. Now, go ahead, make one of your own, and let me know in the comments below how it turned out. Until next time, please like, share, and subscribe. And bon appetit. See you soon. I'm going for it again. Mm. Mm-hmm.